All strapped in and ready to go, Crew-10 eagerly waited inside the Falcon rocket before their scheduled liftoff from NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Eight minutes after the launch, the Falcon 9 rocket successfully touched down at SpaceX's landing zone one at the Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida. The launch was supposed to happen on Wednesday, but was postponed after concerns over a critical hydraulic system. It was called off 43 minutes before takeoff. And we are throttling down the engines. An eight-day trip for Wilmore and Williams inside the Boeing's new Starliner capsule started in June and turned into a nine-month-long stay after the capsule experienced several problems. Back on Earth, Williams has not been forgotten, especially here at the Sunita L. Williams Elementary School, where she visited shortly before she left for space. You know, she's not some kind of ethereal figure. She's a real human that people in this town, you know, knew when she was growing up and that the kids who live here now also see as a role model. And we will be following their return to Earth very closely. I'll send it back to you guys. All right, Jericho, thank you.